The Multua Lite 2 has pan mode, tilt mode, pan and tilt mode, all lock mode. The Multua Lite 2 defaults to pan mode after it's turned on. The thumb controller screen will show the follow mode as yaw. Just rotate the handlebar and the gimbal pan axis will follow. Single press the options button. The thumb controller screen will show the follow mode as pit. The follow mode switches to tilt mode. Move the handlebar up and down. The tilt axis will follow. Single press the options button. The thumb controller screen will display the follow mode as yaw pit. The follow mode switches to pan and tilt mode. Rotate the handlebar up and down, left and right. The pan and tilt axis will follow. Single press the options button. The thumb controller screen will display the follow mode as all lock. The follow mode switches to all lock mode. Rotate the handlebar up and down or left and right. The pan and tilt axis will remain in a fixed position. Single press options again. It goes back to the pan mode. There are three operation modes, underslung mode, briefcase mode, and upright mode. The underslung mode is the standard mode. You can hold the handles with both hands or grip the top bar with a single hand. This mode is convenient for picking up and storing the gimbal on the stand as well as for operating the wireless thumb controller. To enter briefcase mode, start with the Moitoa Lite 2 in the underslung mode. Then, rotate it upwards by 90 degrees until the tilt axis stands on the pan axis. Next, rotate one handlebar by 90 degrees so that the handlebars are right on top of one another. Briefcase mode reduces the gimbal to its smallest size, making it perfect for shooting in narrow spaces. To enter upright mode, rotate the Moitoa Lite 2 upwards by 180 degrees so that the handlebar is right below the camera. In the upright mode, the camera position is higher than normal mode, which makes it easier for you to view the camera screen. This mode will also help you reach a higher shooting angle.